Hey guys, welcome back to Thorough Capping. Um, just here to do a quick review of the uh, Saratoga card today, 722. And I'm mainly going to stay on this screen for two reasons. One, it's pretty clear and concise. And two, just introduce you to a grid that I like to use for to kind of sort my selections based on um, if my tickets are going to be short, if I need a short leg, middle depth, or if I'm going to go deep. And that could be for verticals, such as exa uh, exactus, trifectus, superfectus, as well as the multi-race wagers, the horizontals. But when we look through here, there were a lot of scratches today. This was my original that I put together last night after I made my video. And we see the 1A was scratched out of the second. The, um, the what do you call it, the 7 was scratched out of the third. 2 and the 3 out of the fourth, and so forth. So... This was my grid for this I made this morning. Now, I wasn't around most of the day, but I did get some wagers in, and I was luck happy that um, I, I wagered ahead because there was a nice exacta and trifecta in this sequence here in this card, and that was in race eight. I had three horse won the race at twelve to one. Um, paid something like twenty six eighty. I don't know what it was. Now, unfortunately, I had the four to win. Um, I played the four. If we, when we look at my uh, actual grid for that race, Saratoga 722, race eight. I went with the target and ability, the four. And I had the three seconds. So we I, we had the, almost had the exact cold. That was the race where I said that one horse, uh, there was a one and a one A. They were both outclassing everybody else coming from grade, grade one stakes races. One was a shipper from Europe, but neither of them ran since 2022. And uh, he, they ended, he ended up finished fourth. The race came out 4 3 8 1. So this second ticket that I talked about here, the second set of selections, um, pretty much nailed it all four there. The 3 4 8 trifecta paid $429 for 50 cents. And I think the exact that paid something like 82. I had both of them, but unfortunately, I did not have anything to win on the three uh, the three horse, which I should have just split my win ticket and played. You know, I played ten to win on the four. I should have played five and five on each, and it could have padded. But I made it out for the day anyway. Uh, let's take a look real quick at the rundown. Uh, we started out strong, even though it was chalky. Seven four two. Missed the fourth race. I think the eight won the fourth, so I was off the mark in race four. Uh, race five was won by the one. Race six was won by the three. Uh, race eight, race seven was the uh, other maiden special weight, along with race number one, first time starters. Um, I tried to beat the five in that race. The five was the favorite. Uh, the five got beat, or the five won the race. Uh, three horse was the big one. Race eight that I was talking about, two, eight, and then the eleven horse was a long shot in race eleven to cap it off, and I did not I did not see the eleven. But out of the races I did hit, all my winners came from either the short category or the mid range category. So I mean I, I made money on the day mainly because of the race eight. That exacta and that trifecta. Um, I didn't play the superfecta, but the ten cent superfecta eight or three four eight one paid. I think it was one hundred ninety dollars for ten cents. So all in all, it was a pretty good day, and I just wanted to make this video short. I didn't want to go too long with it, and I'll take a look at what we have. What has Saratoga has to offer, or somewhere else has to offer for tomorrow, and I may put a video up for uh, something tomorrow. All right, thanks for tuning in.